Welcome back to News Across Nigeria. The Nigerian Naval Engineering College in Ogorode, Sapele in Delta State, has graduated 25 officers in the different engineering courses. The flag officer commanding Naval Training Command, Rear Admiral Adeni Yoshinowo, advised the graduating officers to remain focused in their service to the country, especially in the fight against piracy and oil theft. Smartly dressed in their ceremonial outfits, these officers, 25 of them, graduated from the Naval Engineering School, Sapele, Delta State, after a year's training in marine and weapons engineering. They are now ready to take up the challenge of utilizing what they've learned from the college. A quick run through some of the courses undergone by the graduating students. Students of two group and individual projects during which they were expected to apply the knowledge they, they gained during the course into a tangible project that is expected to find useful application in the general society or particular application in the Nigerian Navy. Each group also tasked to research into different topics that uh, could offer solutions to various challenges in the Nigerian Navy. And then they are presented with their certificates. The flag officer commanding Naval Training Command, Rear Admiral Adeni Yoshinowo, underlines the importance of naval engineers to fighting piracy and oil theft in the Nigerian waterways. The gentlemen that have passed out today from the officer's application course and the special duty uh, course um, have been trained to meet this requirement. Uh, they have also been equipped with necessary skills to be able to ensure that the ship is in top condition and available for naval operational requirements. This is what has been achieved uh, with uh, the set of uh, graduates that uh, we have passed out today. And as we deploy them into the field, into the fleet, we expect that they will be able to contribute significantly to the improved availability of the fleet. With this addition to the personnel of the Nigerian Navy, the command is sounding a warning to sea pirates and illegal operators to desist from crimes along the nation's waterways and that anyone caught will be made to face the full wrath of the law. Finally, Dr. Takwe Aluko, a former secretary of the People's Democratic Party in Ekiti State, is making peace with the governor, Ayo Fayoshe, less than three months after he made some damning allegations on channels television about how he claimed the AKT 2014 governorship election was rigged. Dr. Aluko has come forward to reconcile with Governor Fayoshe, whom he said was the architect of a grand plan of how the AKT elections was rigged in the favor of the PDP. However, Dr. Aluko in January told, uh, alleged that huge sums of money were spent to manipulate INEC and the military in favor of Mr. Ayo Fayoshe. At about midnight on Sunday, he was caught on camera on reasons for his move. You talk about betrayer, sir. You talk about betrayer in your interview. About what? Betrayer, that you were betrayed. But then, am I not standing beside him now? That means you, you, have, you have you rally around to get what you want, sir? No, no, this is not about position. This is about peace. This is about misunderstanding. This is about talking together. This is about family community. This is about um, uh, women in Nigeria stepping in. And that's what we have achieved now. You gave far-reaching allegations about the governor. Are you, ret are you retracting those what things? What I am saying is that as far as there are people that are on it, and there are issues that we are talking about. But what I'm saying now is that I'm here. I'm here. We did the wedding yesterday. And tonight, you see us, you can see that there are very many Nigerians around, and the whole family. We have dissolved. Are you saying that all of those things that you said are not no, true? We are moving forward, Shio. We are moving forward. For well, whatever has happened in the past, I, mean, I am I am the father, and I should be seen as the father. And we should, uh, I should see it as one of those things, and accommodate everybody. If I leave him to the whole world, who will be there for him? Nobody. 
and I am his father and his brother, whatever the past has held for all of us, and he is father. Have you forgiven him, sir? Have you forgiven him, sir? Well, you see, whether, whether you are talking of forgiveness, and you could miss my boy, my son. Like I said, whatever has happened, even if, if, if whatever you are saying, in the public, whatever you say, whatever you are saying, there's time to move forward on that. We are moving forward. Thank, thank, you, thank you very much. Mr. Ayofayo Sheikh, it is State Governor. On that note, we'll bring this edition of News Across Nigeria to a close. I'm Olumide Macaulay. See you again. <laughs>